Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do a quick mesh convergence without having to enter a different mesh each time and then collect them all. You can just have console do it all at once. So we're going to go down to our mesh and currently that's the element size we tell you to input. So I'm going to take that value, get rid of it. We're going to replace it with Emacs. I'm going to go up to global definitions. That's be in this global definitions. You're going to click parameters. Oops. Click the value there. And we'll do Emacs there. Don't worry what this value is. doesn't really matter. I'm just saving it. Okay. So now I'm going to right click on study one. Do a parametric sweep. Oh, just click add. And I can see Emacs. I have no other parameters to add. So that's the value I want to look at. Let's assume that's the converged value. So let me start at 0 0.005. And then go to 0 0.001 and then 0 0.0005 and then that final value to see how well we've converged. This sweep type, we'll talk about that later. That's when you have more than one parameter. So then all you have to do is right click and click compute and it will run through all of them. What you'll see down here is the, very, the parameter it's looking at and the time it's going over and I'll come back in a second. Okay, so now we have completed the um, parametric sweep. Let's go look at a point real quick. So we're just going to use the same point as before. Let's go make sure it's on the graph. Cool. Now we're going to add a 1D plot group point graph, cut point 2D, and notice how it says all the parameters, all the time, so we're just going to click plot. And so I don't know which one's which, so we just go to legend, show legend, and we get to see which, which graph is which. So the blue is the most refined mesh, the baby blue. And so if we zoom in here, we see it's nice and smooth, while green and dark blue are a little too rough. And then red is getting there, and then baby blue is pretty much converged. So obviously we have a converged mesh, and that is how you quickly do a mesh convergence test.